Yo, what's up, guys? It's your boy WMW3 Gameplays, and today's video, guys, we'll be talking about the top five biggest tech fails of the century or 2016. There's gonna be some new ones on the list and some as old ones as well. And before I do start off this video, I am not hating up any of these technologies. I personally think they are fantastic companies, but they just had fails all around. So yeah, my honorable mention goes to the Apple Newton. So if you guys didn't know what an Apple Newton was, this thing was back around like 1992 to 1993. And this was basically like a predecessor to an iPad. It was a professional digital assistant. It did many things the same as an iPad, iPhone, and it had a calendar, do list, currency converter, time zone, map, address book. It was basically like an iPad, but in the 19th century. Well, 19 iPad, basically, 1900 iPad, if that makes any sense. It tried to do mo most of the thing like an iPad, and it could also be used to send facts. So it was like an all around type of ipad looking thing and this thing didn't go too well so yeah this would be my number honorary mention or number six as you can say it so my number five pick goes to the uh, garmin new v phone so the garmin is well known for their gps service so if you didn't know garmin makes like gps navigation fitness watches and all that other stuff and what they did was garmin tried to make a garmin phone basically they try to have like navigation was free basically in 2008 they decided to make a smartphone that came with a car dock and it had their navigation system built into a hands-free calling great geotagging and camera built-in camera oh shit social networking so it it and why didn't consumer want it basically iphone was back there and so people saw iphone was gonna be more of a hit than a nav garmin um phone so yeah this this thing didn't take off that much at all so yeah good good try for garmin and they they try to compete in the smartphone market our number four goes to the clippy who does not remember clippy guys clippy is basically a a helper basically on your windows computer and if you guys didn't know clippy Clippy was an office assistant tells you how, tells you how if you forget big annoying clipper that would pop up and I would ask you a stupid question basically. If you wanted help writing a letter or spelling and stuff like that, it it tells you what it is. And it was the one of the most annoyingest thing ever and Microsoft killed it off in 27 2007 so our number three goes to the Windows phone. Who does not remember Windows phone guys back in the day Windows was one of those phones that you wanted now in today's market like windows blackberry those are those phones are non non-existent at this point so let's get right into it. windows phone was the newest technology that has been discount discontinued basically it's probably because the sales were up sales were down 7.5 million windows phone shipped in second quarter this year was down 9.4 percent same in the last year the phone had nearly five percent of the share market in the year so why was this such a big consumer prefers iphone and android windows phone has less app isn't cheaper or it does not have better technology than an iphone ipad or android so those are some couple of reasons why and our number second pick goes to the smartwatches, guys. The smartwatches aren't that big, basically. I have an Apple Watch. I don't put that on very often because of charging and all. It's not good as people may think it is, basically. So, for instance, Apple just announced their iWatch it released in 2015, but it's a gamble because other smartwatches were before that, before the iWatch was, wasn't exactly successful. Well, smartphone, so well, smartwatches was, have been set been around sex been around since the early 1970s they have been booming and busting for the last time. in 2003 however a watchmaker folios released a ran a palm operating system in 24 released by microsoft that had a fm wave and it had it has been discontinued discontinued because it was not a good watch there are several smartwatches available right now such as the pebble watch smartwatch and there aren't exactly new rolexes basically so a lot of people may not find useful for smartwatches as well so my number one pick goes to the 3d televisions guys who does not remember 3d television you put on a glass then you see you, like the you see like the thing popping out yeah that's pretty much has been dead like we do not see anywhere 3d and television so 3d television had never took off 
the manufacturer ant anticipated basically so, so so why did this something fail there are a limited channels available in the wide network television and 3d exclusive which is also a television not worth the price the price of the television was fifteen hundred dollars to forty thousand dollars also many of the television required you to wear a glass and what exactly is not comfortable and although the project hasn't failed completely but it's likely that it's not gonna go anywhere because of 4k and stuff like that so if you guys did enjoy this video remember to just smack a like man that's a much appreciated guys happy you have a wonderful saturday and peace out